everyone and uh, welcome to Thriving with Tyler. Today we got um, a craft that we're going to do, kind of a craft activity mix since we didn't do an activity on Friday. So first things first, let me go over some things. Um, OCO.org has a bunch of different resources available um, to make sure you guys check that out. They've got updated food lists, um, supply distribution lists all around Oswego County. Um, OCO does also provide um, a, a lot of needs, such as um, hotline needs, crisis and development services, health services, transportation information, and education resources. So if you need to go, go to um, OCO.org and look those up. And um, the whole list is right there. And I'll also put the uh, links down in the comments so that way it's easy for anybody that needs it to go to. Make sure you guys also check out Coffee with Caitlin from yesterday. Grab your coffee and enjoy what she's got to say. Coffee. She usually does hazelnut coffee. Ugh, I know I like caramel swirl. All right. And now on to our craft. So today's craft, we are doing durable, strong, big bubbles. It's going to be really cool. Um, sometimes you can use gl uh, glycerin. It's found in the craft aisle, but today we're actually going to be using home, you know, home stuff because everybody's got random things lying at home. So we're going to be using corn syrup, dish soap, and water. All right, so let's get started. First, you're going to want to put your water into the cup or into your bowl. Perfect. I did two and a half cups of water. That's okay. And then we're going to do one cup of Dawn dish soap. So hold your Dawn dish soap there, Lena. Or hold up. Quick, dump it. Nice. Good job. Let me see. My All right. And then we need. Does that look cool? Next, we need a fourth cup of corn syrup. Now I found this on Pinterest, and they um, also had like a like I said a lot of glycerin. Um, one. All right, go ahead. Good job. Mix it at home. This is pretty much making soap at home. Yeah. All right. Mix that all together. Let's dip it and then. Oh. Can I turn? Yeah. You want, to, you want to try it? Nice and slow. The trick is to do it slow. Oh, see, it went too fast. Right, I want to try this too. <gasps> Bubbles. Can I try that? Can I try? Ready? No, I don't. <laughs> All right, and there you have it. You've got bubbles. Super quick, super easy. Uh, I bet you if you added a little bit more corn syrup, they might be stronger. And that is Thriving with Tyler today. Thank you guys so much. We hope you guys enjoyed it. You can, oh, look at the bubbles. Uh, you can put this in like a storage container. So if you got like a um, mason jar or anything like that with a top, feel free to like save this and use it, you know, on a different date when it's sunny out. Um... Don't poke it, don't poke it. Let her be. Can I try? <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you guys have a lot of bubble fun today. We will see you guys on Friday for another activity. We'll yeah. see you guys on Friday. Yeah. Have a great week. Bye. Bye. There you go. Keep going, Lee. Good job! That looks awesome!